Okay, right. Um, hi people, as I mentioned before, I'm going to do a demonstration on the Creatist Pro. Uh, so I decided to do a latte macchiato. So I've simply turned the machine on, it's warmed up. I have uh, enough water in the tank um, and I've selected it through the display. Now, the pot I'm going to use is the Kazar, Inspired Inspiration Kazar, which is a strength of 12. Uh, pop in the pot, and I have a pitcher, pitcher full of milk, which is probably just enough for the glass or for the cup. And the first thing I will do is pop the jug under the steam wand in and glass is under now it's a simple process touch the display screen gives you the the picture of the drink and it also gives you the option to increase the temperature of your milk or increase the volume into the the cup so you do have a little bit of variation uh, now to start the process we just hit the arrow and that is now starting to steam, steam and froth the milk. And it will do that first because of the type of drink that it, that it is, being a mate and macchiato as opposed to a mate. Okay, right, well, we're back. The milk is just finishing off. Once that's finished, it will give me the next step to do. I'm using a, um, just a normal latte glass to do, to do this one. Um, to do a slightly bigger one, you can use a recipe glass. Right. That's it finishing up now. Okay, now, if you look at the screen it's given you the prompt the next steps to do i don't know whether you can see it and understand it but it yeah okay so what we do now is take the jug out from the wand give that a wipe off and that will now go into its automatic clean cycle now that's pause the machine little stir of the milk and fill, fill the glass. We try and get enough milk to leave enough room for the pod or for the machine to do the coffee. Now the coffee symbol is now flashing which means we just touch that and it's now put itself into the process of brewing Coffee. It's extracting the coffee now. And the simplicity of the machine is it's just a simple task. There's nothing difficult about it. Um, it's now finished brewing, brewing the coffee. Now, if you wanted to, you could put another pod in to give you a slightly stronger, stronger coffee taste. Um, so now that's gone into its finishing mode. So. It's given you the symbol that it's completed and now it's gone back to its normal normal display. So you take that out. And here's your drink. Um, just, and it's usually meant to just sort of go from a nice thick froth down and, and fade away. Fade, and that's just a normal um, latte macchiato. As opposed to a latte it will give you a thinner, uh, a thinner froth line and a dense, more denser froth across the top so uh, hopefully you've you will enjoy that um, and I hope it's been a bit of a pleasure, pleasure. and thank you for, for watching if you do